I was sitting in a London tube train and I noticed a man sitting opposite me in a dark suit for the office but with a mass of dandruff on his collar. He started smiling to himself. Some glittering fancy minces through his brain, plucks peacock feathers from star-spangled air, hangs rainbows from his undistinguished hair and tugs him like a child with daisy chain away from briefcase pasties, away from under-balance sheet clouds in stomach ulcer skies, as for a moment his parched mud-flat eyes flood with a far monsoon whose tiger thunder only he in his dandruff suit can hear. Is it some Cleopatra on some Nile ready to crown him as Sir Antony? Is it that God has whispered in his ear? Is it some masterpiece of man's folly? We shall not know, but may applaud his smile.